Presidential Son and House Deputy Speaker Paulo Duterte once again threatens to stage a coup against Speaker Alan Peter Cayetano. He says lawmakers complain of inequitable shares for their districts in the proposed 4.5 trillion peso budget in 2021. He confirmed Sunday, September 20, that he told a Viber group of lawmakers he will ask the Mindanao Bloc to declare the positions of Speaker and Deputy Speakers vacant on Monday, September 21. This move will formally set the stage for a coup d'etat in the House. The presidential son adds several lawmakers expressed their mistrust of the Cayetano-led House leadership. But come Monday, the coup does not push through. This is not the first time Paulo Duterte threatened a coup against Cayetano. Meantime, Deputy Speaker El Rey Villafuerte and Negros Oriental Representative Arnulfo Arnie Tevez stooped to name-calling in a world war over the 2021 budget. Their favorite slur, gay, clearly the two congressmen think being gay is cause for shame. Villafuerte is the ally of House Speaker Alan Peter Cayetano, while Tevez is the ally of Lord Alan Velasco, who is in a term-sharing agreement with Cayetano. Tevez threw the first below-the-belt punch in a viber group of the lawmakers. He tells Villafuerte, we all know you're gay. Villafuerte in turn hits back at Tevez. Maybe you're the gay one because you're all talk. He adds, but you're a coward. You're all talk. You might even cry again. Tevez then challenged Villafuerte to a physical fight. He also calls him a homosexual slur. Villafuerte had the last word though by calling Tevez the same slur but also throws in bansot or stunted.